Hey, the water's starting to warm up. What bank should we concentrate on to find the warmest water and we'll probably find more fish? Good morning, guys and girls. Golly, we got some great weather going on in Oklahoma. The snow is just back in our minds. It's just history making, and it made history. February 26, looking at Romans, the book of Romans 12, 6. We all have different gifts, each of which came because of the grace that God gave us. All of our gifts are because of God's grace. A young man about nine or ten years old asked me if I'd been a professional fisherman since I was a kid. I told him no, I hadn't, but that I'd loved fishing since I was old enough to walk. There was no such thing as a professional fisherman until many years after I graduated from college. Even then though, God knew that there would be pros, and He had given me and others the ability to be professional bass fishermen. You know, I've got friends that have amazing abilities and talents and gifts, amazing. I, I, Toby Keith and Blake Shelton, who can have, God gave them the ability to not only write songs, but to be able to sing them, and the rest of us just love listening to them and watching them sing. I've got friends that, uh, that uh, you know, can throw a 100 mile hour fastball and, and strike out major league hitters. I, I've got friends that are major league hitters that can, hit a major league pitcher's fastball, you know, a mile long just about. I've got friends that, uh, that are congressmen and senators and even presidents. God gave them abilities that he didn't give me. No ability at all to do any of that kind of stuff. Uh, I've got a friend, Martin Truax, who's got ability to drive a race car 180, 190, 200 miles an hour around a circle with other race cars inches away from him, walls inches away from him. God gave him that special talent to be able to do that. Realize this, whatever ability or talent that you have has come from God. What can you really do good? Some of you might say, well, I can't do anything good. Well, God gave you ability to do something really, really good. He gave you a gift, he gave you a talent, he gave you an ability. It came from God. He has given you these abilities, here's the key. God gave you your talents, your abilities, to use for his glory. You know, I've got a friend, uh, Bob Sellers, who sang with the Kingsman. Incredible singer. God gave him that talent. He knows it, and he's used it his entire life for God's glory. He has given you whatever ability and talents you have to use for his glory. Use them for that purpose today. Use the abilities and the gifts that God's given you for his glory today. Whatever you do, do for the glory of God. And I'm going to tell you what, when that happens, God will give you a lot of glory too. You might not become a world famous pitcher or hitter or singer or race car driver or politician, but you'll have to do just exactly what God wants you to do for His glory. Okay, here's our tip for today, and this is a good one because this is definitely the time of the year when this happens. You know, we just went through. Uh, golly, just a few days ago, as a matter of fact, it seems like that, you know, it's just a week ago, the worst cold front that we ever had here in the state of Oklahoma. The, mo the worst it's been since we've had a state, the, the lowest temperature since we've had a state. I've lived a long time and I've never seen temperatures like that, never, ever. And it happened all over the South. It happened all over the Midwest. And yet here we are, God has turned it around and God is getting ready to paint the snow a beautiful green. He's getting ready to turn this dead grass and dead trees that you're looking at. He's getting ready to turn that into a beautiful green world. And he's going to do it pretty quick. And he's getting ready to warm that water up. He's getting ready to warm that water up where you and I can go out there and catch a bunch of fish. Where do we look? We look on windy banks on the north and east shorelines. They warm up faster earlier in the year and those fish will come to them like a magnet. The banks that we're looking at right over there, right around that corner going up into Johnson Creek, that right over there, the banks on that side, the banks on that side, the windy banks on that side, a day like today, a day like today, it's going to be up there probably 55 degrees today, it's going to warm some of that surface water up, the south wind is going to blow that surface water up there in that creek, this will be one of the best creeks you could fish early in the year on this lake. 
Guys and girls, go out there and have you a great one today. And remember, I love you.